Oh. Should be good to go. I'll just add the finishing touches and there. Looks good. Josh and I are on our way. Oh, bring the air. Oh god, we're gonna get drunk again. Hey, nice view. Yeah, I noticed. Fly like foot. And now to watch that sweet, sweet burn. Oh, honey, no, don't, don't sit on the outside of the rail. Yes, please, Josh. Should we Josh. it properly? Dude, I don't question you about crypto shit, do I? Guys, shut up. I'm in. Always got a surprise for them already. I brought our newest device with me, and I'm happy to announce the launch of Home 2.0. Hell yeah! Simple push of a button. That's the dead sec logo. Oh, I'm sorry. Would you care to have it? Nice! Turn it off! We're done. We're done here. We're done. Citizens of the digital age, welcome, come, come. Home thought they could fool you. They sold you a system to monitor your homes, promising privacy, security, and convenience. Home is selling your habits. habits. In fact, you pay a monthly subscription fee for the privilege of being sold to the highest bidder. It's time to wake up. Reclaim the value inherent to who you are. If you don't control that information, someone else will. You can pray our corporations treat you favorably, or you can take matters into your own hands. DedSec has given you the truth. Do what you will. That was Steven, humiliating! Steven, Steven. You took a bad beat, buddy. It happens. Listen to me, you smart son of a bitch. You promise! Uh, Not your smartest move, Steven. You've had some monumental fuck-ups recently. Sit down. Uh, dude, I gave you the means to, you know, be proactive with all that data. And you screwed the pooch on fucking television, dude. Somebody's probably doing an auto tune of your interview right now. Don't go near dead sec. They're my responsibility. All you need to do is figure out an apology to my lawyers for laying your hands on me. You gonna be okay? You gonna be okay? Say yes. There you go. I'm gonna get you a glass of water. Okay. That's that. I like that um, guy. The villain, I think, is who that's gonna be. Oh boy. Hell yes, I'll take 87,000 followers. You know what I'm gonna do? I am going to get some social engineering stuff. Because... Oh. Ooh. I'm gonna get this. Oh, it costs eight botnet resources? See, that's a good thing, because I steal all the money I can. Uh... But, we'll get that later. Um, we need botnet stuff. So, let's grab that. And, now it looks like... Looks like 12 botnet. Hey Marcus, one of our followers swept an email from a home student. Juicy shit, my friend. Boy. Okay. 
So. I think what I'm going to be doing... Guys, I got a lead on a potential pedophile working for home. For fuck's sake. Big Brother's a sex offender? This is exactly why we went after home. So who is this guy? Cole something or other. I don't have a last name. We probably got an employee list from our home hit. Let's see. Uh-huh. Cole Lang. I'll find him. Get some evidence. See what kind of person home is harboring. Okay. So I will be doing that. I think what I'm going to be doing... Get my things, man. I'm going to get out of here. Yeah. Okay. I slept with him. Noodle is at it again. The search engine giant announced they will be acquiring yet another startup tech company. This time, it's InstaWheels. Noodle purchased the car sharing startup for $750 million. The startup's future was already threatened by Driver San Francisco. But tech insiders say that with Noodle integrating its search and map functions into the InstaWheels sharing service, it will dominate the marketplace. This is considered a shot across the bow at Noodle competitors such as Invite, who has also been expanding its portfolio of startups. Sorry about your car, Marcus, buddy. What does home system look like to you? CTOS Junior. So it wouldn't surprise you to know that they've got a deal going on with Bloom. After what we just did to them? Yes. I bet all deals are off now. What were the terms? CTOS code is the base of home software. Collected data sold back to Bloom. At a hefty discount, of course. Sounds like we showed up at the right time, then. Okay, so what I'm going to do... The side stuff, like the painting and stuff, I'm going to do on my own time. And, uh, oh, what I should do is pick these up. But I think I'm going to try to try to bring this to more of a mainline only thing when I record. Because there's a lot of stuff in this. Like, there's way, way more than I thought there was originally. Shush. But what I will do right now is I will go collect some of these. Because I've been wanting to and I haven't. So... Sorry, I just wanted to pet the dog. Um, it's all gone to the dogs, buddy. Oh God. Uh, I actually saw something like really depressing at one point. Um. Uh, the, there, there was like a really depressing thing where I hacked somebody's text messages and then it just said, hey, you know I love you, right? And the person's like, yeah, I love you too. And then it's just, I, uh, I'm sorry for what I'm about to do. And then they never replied again. And the person was like freaking out. And I got really sad. This game is like weirdly... Found something weird. Sweet! Get a picture. No, I mean, my MC catcher detector is going off. We really need to find a better name for that. Why? That's the technical name. My stingray sniffer tells me somebody's leeching data off of people's phones below. Looks like the data's going to... Koi Tao. See? Weird. Weird indeed. Okay, so... These all unlock new missions. There's a lot in this game. I don't know if you realize, but there's a lot of shit happening right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to unlock these, and if any of them seem particularly interesting, 
I will record them, and the rest I will do on my own, on my own time. But, uh, we'll, we'll see what happens. I'm gonna go talk to this person here. Hey, dude. Oh, okay. Hi. I just learned about some kind of gangster swap meet. Shoes and Bratva. Why do you want to anger two different homicidal crime groups at the same time? Because everybody loves a vigilante. Actually, public opinion is pretty mixed on them. Not for dead sex target audience. We keep making trouble for the indisputable bad guys. We gain followers. It's easy math. Your math is sound there. I'm gonna pay the shoes a visit and see what I can find out. Hey, you. All right. We'll do that, but... I will do that later. Uh, yeah. So, this is... This is cool, though, because a lot of it... Like, I don't have to do any of this, actually. Like, th none of this is at all required for playing this game. But it's all there for, like, a... For, like, excess stuff. Uh, no, no, no. You, hack. Guys, has DeadSec ever run a Farmingtons up? Farmingtons? Why would we? No idea. But it looks like they've been firing employees who take even a passing interest in us. That's probably illegal. I'm gonna visit one of their pharmacies and see if I can get into the company system. Find out what's going on behind the scenes there. Hey, um, while you're there, I have a few prescriptions that need refilling under Josh's name, of course. Have you been stealing my pills? What? Oh, that's... No, <laughs> of course not. Forget asked. Oh, jeez, there are so many. And some of these are co-op things, too. Uh, it, it's, it's, it's interesting how this game more than a little reflects what... It, it's weird how this is made in the time that it happened, but this is essentially the exact same story as, wait, what? Talk to you? Oh, talk, not hack. Um, this is huh? essentially the same kind of story as Metal Gear Solid 2. Man, what's a brother gotta do? My insurance rates go up for no damn reason every month. You understand? Every damn month. Every month for no reason? I call Probably Blue, but they just gave me some runaround. Risk clause, they tell me. It's a bullshit clause, is what it is. Same thing happens to almost everybody I know. Goddamn insurance. Anybody here use Prava Blue insurance? No. I hacked my government payout to give me full coverage. Who the fuck needs insurance? Why? What's Prava Blue up to? Sounds like they're ripping people off with a risk clause. Seems like a good reason to look around in Provi Blue's servers. It'll go faster if I have a password. Finding an employee near you right now. There he is. IT guy. He'll have one. Alright, I think we're almost done collecting these. Yeah, there's one up here. Alright, uh, I'll do that one on my own. I'm gonna go quick, go to the hacker space really quickly and go check if there's anything new to print or grab or anything like that. And, uh, yeah, I... Hmm. I, I do find it interesting that, like, how many years ago was Metal Gear Solid 2, but Kojima was able to predict this kind of shit, and now this is not... Like, the shit that's happening in this game is... Fan... It's fanciful in terms of the way that it's done, but the amount of surveillance and stuff is not at all. Like, I would 100% see, like, iHome or any... or. Google Home or any of the other ones like doing this exact kind of stuff. Um, so it's it's just weird to look at it and know that this is probably all real in some strange way. Also, I want a different paint job. 
can I get a different paint job? OMG, it's dead sec. I'll spend eight thousand dollars on. It. Wait, what? What to say? What the hell? Uh, paint jobs. Mm. You know, what? let's just make everything dead sec colored. There we go. Also, I should 3D print a gun of some sort. Wait, can I not? Oh, I don't have it. That's why. Uh, I could make pretty much all these. Core dump pistol. Low damage, high stability, decent-ish range. Zero day rifle. See, I wish that these were... Really? A grenade launcher? Uh, I wish that these were... Um, a stun launcher! Hey! Grenade launcher fitted with stun gun electrodes, enabling the user to quickly stun a group of enemies without killing them. That is exactly what I want. It looks like a fucking nerf gun. I love it. Now, this is bad for, uh... It's bad for my, uh, ability to take down ha other hackers, but it's worth it for the fact that I can fucking just... I, I can just take out large groups of enemies now without having to worry about one at a time shooting them. Cool, I don't have to kill a bunch of people now. Awesome. But, uh, yeah, it's... Ah, God, I... I actually want to, like, talk about this game at some point, so I think I'm going to do that. I'm pretty I'm going to revive uh, Backlog again and talk about this and some other games. Uh, anyway, I'm going to go do all those side ops, and uh, I'll record them if they're interesting. Uh, I'll, I'll record them, and if they are interesting, I will actually upload it if they're not, or if they're, if they're you know, just things, then I won't. Sorry, I didn't hear that. Pop quiz, guys. What does every game and website love most? Being considered journalism? Leaks. They pay through the nose for them, especially if it's a leak from one of the big studios like, oh, I don't know, Ubisoft? Marcus, don't toy with my fragile heart. What do you got? Just a lead. New game trailer from UB San Francisco. Mm. I can smell all those followers we'd nab. Yeah, I'll see if I can fit a Ubisoft heist into my schedule. So, I've been running around doing stuff, and, uh, I figured this one would be good to do. I like the little shot at, uh, games, uh, websites there. Although, you know what Ubisoft likes to be considered most? Competent game developers. Uh, th this, this game kind of proves that they are, but at the same time, most of the games don't. Uh... I actually had a really funny thing because I, this this started so I quickly exited the game and as soon as I did a little ad popped up from Uplay saying buy Watch Dogs 2. You mean the game I've sunk 20 hours into in the last week? Yes, let me purchase it again, Ubisoft. That vehicle's out of control. Uh, what was I going to do? That's a cap. Let us hack uh is this one? No. Kicking it old school? No, that's another one I picked up. Uh, it'll be stolen. Here we go. Where are we heading? Oof. That's not that far. So, I've been doing some of the uh, side missions. Nothing too terrible. Um, there was one that I'm still in the middle of that... Uh, I stopped a guy from jumping off a building. He's trying to leak a government contractor that's siphoning off uh, people's data and, se and sending it somewhere. Uh, I'm not... It, it, it's not super interesting. Um, another one I'm doing right now is uh, messing around with an ATM exploit. So that's fun. I gave a student... She was an older lady, and she was a student. She only made $10,000 a year, so I gave her $1,200. Um, outside of that, meh, nothing really exciting right now.
I got into a couple firefights, did a little bit more of the online stuff. Uh, yeah. Nothing else, honestly. But, oh, I also got, um, unlocked the ability to call cops on people. And I unlocked, uh, some other, like, house hacking and security hacking and stuff like that. So, I can shut down security systems now, which is kind of a huge deal. Because I have a feeling that shit's going to get in my way later. But, for now, let us... Okay. As a matter of fact, one moment. 